So this one goes with the video that I just made about partial activation of your trigger gear, but I figured I'd just make a little rundown of um, if your trigger doesn't work at all on here, other things it could, or just problems with these two buttons in general on BDM 10s and 20s. So a lot with issues with these, most likely it's one of these cables here. Now one of these being bad can make the other one not work. So like if something's wrong with this cable, if it's got a short net or like one of the contacts is broken somewhere, it can make this not work. So you'll want to check this. These ones on the BDM 20s are a lot more durable. The ones on the BDM 10s are really fragile and they rip all the time. So if you have a BDM 10, there's a good chance there's a little tear in it somewhere. These ones, you want to make sure that those aren't peeled up there and that this is clean. And if it's still giving you some trouble, one thing you can do, sometimes it gets dirty in here. You can either dump some 91% or higher isopropyl alcohol or I like to use any kind of electrical contact cleaner. You can just spray some in there and then come in with a toothbrush and try to get it inside there a bit. Clean it out. And then if it comes to it, that in the video that I just made, I took this apart and I do have a dedicated video on taking these apart as well. You may need to replace this, but honestly, it's very rare that you need to replace this. I don't run into that very often where I have to replace the little contact sheet behind these, but you may have to. So, if you're having trouble getting it working, that may be, but that's always the last resort. So, I hope this helped you, and stay tuned for more repair videos.